What's good, y'all? I hope y'all enjoyed y'all Thanksgiving. I hope y'all enjoyed y'all Black Friday. I'm about to head down to the mall and pick up my raffle win. I struggle on the five red four, so let's see how this whole process goes. YouTube, what's good? Welcome back to Thrax Stock Kicks, where I do sneaker reviews, how tos, and sneaker news. I'd like to thank you for tuning in, and we're gonna go ahead and get into an unboxing. If you like the content, go ahead and smash that like button, share this out to all your friends, comment down below, and don't forget to hit that notification bell. This morning, I had to head down to the mall and pick up the bag. I secured the bag. It's crazy because it was only six pairs at Hibbit Sports. When I say six, there were only six pairs. But your boy secured the bag. I don't know what it is, man. The sneaker guys looked down on me. I had a pre-order get canceled for my What The Fives and I was pretty upset about it, but I hit on the raffle of Hibbit, so I'm not too upset about it. I still got to win this month, so I ain't mad at all. But without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this box, man. There you have it. The Air Jordan 4 Fire Red. You know they had to go ahead and throw that Nike Air on the back. This shoe is iconic for the simple fact that it's one of the four OG colorways. Among the OG colorways were the Fire Red Fours, the White Cements, Military Blues, and the Bread Fours. This is my second time having the Fire Reds. I had them the first time when they had the Jumpman on the back of them, and I ended up selling them so that I could cop another pair of Jordans at the time. I don't remember which ones it was. So if we start off with the midsole and the outsole, we got the Fire Red, and the Nike check on the bottom. Got the nice black accent on the midsole. You also got the air bubble. The upper's leather is what's expected out of a four. It's not tumbled, it's not anything that's too soft, but it's a good leather, it's a solid leather. So I'm not mad at the leather on these shoes. I'm not mad at that quality. You got the black with the fire red on the wings, fire red sock liner on the inside, black insole with the fire red Nike Air on the inside, the iconic Air Jordan upside down on the tongue. Jumpman in fire red and flight in black. And then you have the white netting with the black underlay. The same thing on the tongue. So looking at these compared to my other Air Jordan 4s that I have, I think they're pretty good quality. I do see some places where the glue is sticking out a little bit. Some of the stitching could have been tucked in a little bit better, but it's an Air Jordan 4. They usually come like this, so this to be expected. One thing I will say that I'm worried about is going to be the midsole cracking because every single Jordan 4 that I've had has had some type of cracking on that paint and I, I'm just I'm worried about that cracking man it, it's gonna crack I already know it is but I'm gonna try to take care of these so that it doesn't but it's something that's inevitable with these shoes all in all I think this was a good purchase definitely an iconic shoe to have in the collection you have to have an OG colorway with the Nike Air on the back. I don't have many. I think these Fire Red 4s and my Black Metallic 5s might be the only ones that I have that have the Nike Air on the back. I did have a pair of True Blues, but they got stolen when I moved here from overseas. Bummer, but it is what it is, man. Take some losses and you re back up. And that's just the way the sneak game goes. Yeah, man, y'all get in the comments. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about the Fire Red 4s. I think that they're a very dope shoe. I think they're a very nice colorway. It's an OG colorway. Y'all get down in the comments and y'all let me know y'all opinion on the Air Jordan Fire Red 4. Y'all hit the like button, share, comment down below, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Thank y'all for tuning in. This has been Thrax.Kicks, and I'm out.